The following program is closed captioned for the thinking impaired. Hey gang, what's shaking? It's your pale generic soul. Hi Sean, glad you're watching. Hope you laugh. Um, you might think this is uh, just another video about uh, pipes, but and not real, not really, sorta, not entirely. Why am I making this video right now? Because it's sale time, ladies and gentlemen, or rather, trade time. What I'm smoking is Boswell's Maple Leaf. I'm just covering up my last name because you don't need to know it if you're not interested in this. It's, uh, it's an okay tobacco. A little sweet for my flavors. For my flavor getter. And I'm interested if anybody wants to trade up for something else equivalent. It's about four and a half ounces. And, uh, well, it's, it's a great tobacco, but in my mind a little too sweet. And then on top of that, I was supposed to uh, trade with uh, XR Poseidon, but I don't know if he, you know, got hit by a car or just fell off the face of the earth. But... I also have a tin of Sherlock. Okay, there went the lid. A brand new tin. Still fully packed, still dense. My lap is burning. Brand new. No tricks, no nothing. It's all there. I just didn't like the flavor of it. So I'm willing to trade, hopefully somebody out there has got something um, that they're willing to trade. You could take one or both, doesn't matter to me. But as you know, if you smoke pipes, that if you don't like a certain flavor, whether, um, there's no point in keeping it around. I'd, I'd much rather uh, trade this off to somebody who could uh, utilize it a little better than I because, well, it's, again, too sugary for my, my uh, taste. Clearly very smokable, but, again, it just gets to me. Um, in a way that I'm not really, uh, happy with, so. I guess, long story short, if you're interested in trying Boswell's Maple Leaf, send me an email. But, uh, in trade, I'd like, um, the equivalent of four ounces. Uh, be it two tens or, um... Uh, what have not, and of course with the Sherlock, we're going to trade tin for tin on that one, <clears throat> and uh, that'll be that. Again, send me an email right here on good old YouTube, and I will get back to you rather quickly. And also, as a matter of fact, speaking of mail and YouTube, um... I don't know if anybody else is getting this lately because YouTube is um, revamping things and trying to make it better or whatever, but uh, they've got a glitch where uh, it says I've got six brand new emails and they have all been read, but um, 
it says they're still brand new. And when a new mail message comes in, um, it isn't highlighted as new, like normal. I don't know what's going on, but uh, I'm not a fan. If somebody wants to um, tell me what I can do to uh, fix that, please feel free. Be it a comment in this or an email. Also, I've noticed that uh, it seems I can't block subscribers anymore. Um, you can't see your subscribers list, so you don't know who's got videos and who doesn't. So, jackpot for you guys, if you don't have videos, you can still subscribe, and there's not a whole lot I can do about it. So, this isn't something I like, because it lets in uh, all sorts of robots and things like that. Just the little things that get to me. But, uh, yeah, guys, uh, if, if anybody's interested in trading up some tobaccos, please let me know so I don't have to just toss these in the trash because they cost too much. The um, Sherlock, uh, I should have the lid for that before I try to show you the back side of it. In case you missed the introduction video where I said I liked it, I guess I lied, but um, it was $15 for a tin for two ounces, so I don't want money for it, I'd just rather uh, trade up tin for tin on that, but uh, okay guys, I'm waiting. Until next time, don't do anything I wouldn't do. See ya. If you say you like it, you can have some pizza. Do people like pizza?